Hello friends, this video on differential equation part 2 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1. Now we know what is differential equation. We know what is differential equation. Now there is a concept in differential equation that is order and degree of differential equation. So I will tell you what is order and degree of differential equation. Order of a differential equation is nothing but the order, highest order of dependent variable. For example, in this case, it is dy by dx. In this case, if you see, I think this has to be the y. Yeah. This guy, if you see, it is d square y by dx square. Here, if you see, it is d cube y by dx cube is the highest order. Correct. So what you see here is we are concerned about the highest order. So if my in this case my y was the variable, so this becomes highest is dy by dx, that is 1. In this case again the, the variable is y, the highest is d square y by dx2, this is 2. Here also I am talking about uh, d, I am talking about uh, d square d cube y, so this becomes 3. So this is nothing but the highest order. Correct. Please understand this concept clearly. Order is nothing. If you say, see the difference between order and degree, I'll tell you what. When you say y dash, I'm talking about order 1, right? dy by dx is order 1. We know we use this term extensively dy by dx is order 1. So d2y by dx2 is second order derivative. If you, if you remember this term second order derivative, we use this term very frequently. Second order derivative, we use first order derivative, right? So that means when I'm talking about order, I'm talking about it is dy by dx, d2y by dx2, dy by dx cube, those kind of stuff. So order is nothing but the highest. Please note there's a term called highest here. We have to find the highest. In this case, example, I have d square y dx2, d cube y dx cube. I am concerned about only the highest. So highest it is d cube y by dx cube. So in this case, the order will be 3. Let's understand degree of the differential equation. Degree is nothing but the highest power of the highest order. So if we if we know the order for that order, I just find the highest power. Please note highest power of the highest order. But there is a catch what that this differential equation is defined only for polynomial functions. So if my differential equation contains log exponential trigonometric function of derivative then it is not defined that is if my equation contains let's suppose if I have something like uh, dy by dx plus sine of dy by dx then this is not defined. Why? Because it has trigonometric function of derivative. Please note. But if it is let's suppose dy by dx plus sine y is equal to 0 this is okay for this degree is defined. But if it has exponential log or trigonometric for derivative please note derivative here is also a critical word then degree is not defined so if, for example if i have let's suppose dy by dx plus e to the power dy by dx is equal to zero then in this case my degree is not defined but if it is dy by dx plus e to the power y is equal to zero in this case also degree is defined correct so the cash here is it should not have log exponential or trigonometric functions for derivative. So let's let's take some examples for this. So the first is d cube y by dx cube that is third order derivative. This is third order derivative, third order plus x square d square y by dx square that is second order, right? Whole cube is equal to zero. So if you see the maximum order is three, third order. So in this case, order is. The second is, let's check if it has log exponential and trigonometric function for derivative. There is no, no log exponential or trigonometric function. That means my degree is defined. So degree will be in this case, the maximum power of this guy, because it's the maximum power. So maximum power of this guy is 
the maximum power of the maximum order. So maximum order is three. The maximum power of this guy is one. So degree is one. Very simple. Second example, dy by dx first order derivative. Here also dy by dx first order derivative sine square by. So the maximum order is what? One. So order is one. The second is degree. For degree, let's find whether it has log exponential or trigonometric function. Yes, it has the trigonometric function. But whether the trigonometric function is for derivative? No, it is sine y. It is not sine dy by dx. That means degree is defined. Now degree is defined. What is degree? Degree is the highest power of the highest order. Highest order is one anyway. In this case, the highest power is one. In this case, the highest order power is two. So the highest power is two. So degree is two. Correct. See, degree is two in this case because I'm talking about the highest power of highest order. Highest order is first, first only. So the highest power of this guy is two. Let's take some example. D y by d x plus sine d y by d x equal to zero. This is first order derivative. Correct. First order. This guy is also first order. So I'm talking about only first order derivative. So order is one. To find degree, the first the condition is check whether it has log sine or trigonometric function of derivative. Yes, it has sine d by d x. That means the degree is not defined because it has sine d by d x form. Correct. The next is y triple dash. That is, this is third order derivative plus y square no order derivative plus e to the power y dash correct e to the power y dash equal to zero this is first order so maximum order is what three so order will be three now what is the uh, this thing degree for degree i have to check whether it has log or exponential function yes it has and exponential function is for derivative or the variable? No, it is for derivative because it is, is it, it is e to the power y dash. It is not e to the power y. Since it is, it is e to the power y dash, that means my degree is not defined. Correct. Next is x y d square y by d x square. This guy is second order derivative. This guy is first order derivative and this guy is also first order derivative. What is the maximum order of derivative? Second order derivative. So order is two. To find power, we have to check the power of this guy. The power of this guy is one only because this guy is the maximum order derivative. So we are told we find the highest power order and then find the highest power of that. Highest order is two, highest power of this guy is one only. So this guy is one. Let's take one example. dy by dx minus cos x equal to zero. This guy is first order. So highest order is one. Second question is, is, is degree possible? Cos x is there, it is not cos dy by dx, so degree is possible. What is the degree? Highest power, power of this guy, High, power of this guy is one. So degree of this guy is one. That's how we find order and degree. And we'll tell you why to find degree and order because it helps in solving differential equation. Our main target is to solve differential equation to but before we should solve differential equation, we should be comfortable in the terms such as order and degree of differential equation. And that is the reason why we are understanding all this. So we'll take some examples where you to find order and degree if defined for this differential equation. The first is d to the power of 4y by dx square plus sine y to the power 3. Right? So this guy is of fourth order derivative. Correct? This guy is third order derivative. So in this case, my order is what? Order is four. Why? Because it is fourth order derivative. Second is degree. To find degree, first you have to check whether my it has sine log or uh, exponential function. This guy has sine function and that too in derivative form. So in this case, degree is not defined because it is sine of some derivative. The next is y dash plus 5y is equal to 0. This guy is first order. The maximum order is what? 1. To find degree, first check it as sine, co, sine, trigonometric, exponential and log. It doesn't have. So it degree is defined. 
degree is what the maximum power of the highest order that means i am looking for the power of this power of this guy is one only so degree will also be one this example ds by dt order is what one in this case order is two or we'll say second power second order this guy is second order this guy is first order let's not confuse right this guy is first order this guy is second order i am talking about the highest power so highest power is two here so order will be two second is degree for degree first check whether it has cosine or trigonometric exponential that's where functions no it doesn't have so i am talking about degree degree is nothing but the highest power of the highest order that means i am talking about the highest power of this guy and that is one so my degree is one let's take this example here it is second order derivative this guy is first order so my highest power is what two so order will be two for degree i have to check whether it has trigonometric function exponential functions and log function yes it has trigonometric function now check whether the, the trigonometric function is for derivative or for the function the trigonometric function the cos function is for derivative because it is cos of dy by dx that means in this case also degree is not defined correct why not defined because it is cos of dy by dx similarly this example d square y by dx square is equal to cos 3x plus sin 3x this guy is second order right so that means highest order is 2 let's talk about degree for degree first first to check it has cos or sin function or trigonometric function or log function or exponential function yes it has sin cos but whether it has this guy as derivative no it is normal x variable so that means degree is defined degree is what highest power of the highest degree highest order highest power of highest order highest order is this guy power of this guy is 1 Degree is one. One example. Y double dash second order. Y dash first order. Sign by no order. So order is maximum order. Two and one maximum is two. Order is two. Degree is what? To find degree first, check it as sine function. Yes, but it is sine divided by x or sine by. It is sine by. It is not sine of derivative. So my degree is defined. Correct. My degree is defined. What's the degree? degree is the maximum power of the maximum order maximum order is this guy maximum power of this guy is 1 so degree please let me repeat if it is my sine of derivative then my degree is not defined but is my sine of variable y or sin x then my degree is defined same thing applies for exponential exponential derivative degree is not defined exponential x y degree is defined right same thing for log log of dy by dx my degree is not defined but log y log x my degree is defined correct that's how it is thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials Study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.